So let's take a look at a sample problem over here where f of z is z squared minus i and the limit is when z approaches 3 plus 2i. We first separate this into two parts, which is the real function and the imaginary function. Here, the real function is z squared, which is equal to 3 plus 2i squared. We can easily expand it and write it as 3 squared, which is 9, plus 2 times 3 times 2i. That's going to give us 12i. And now the last part we have is 2i squared, which is equal to 4 times i squared. And we know that i squared is equal to minus 1, so we put minus 4 over here. You simplify that, you get 5 plus 12i. Now, let's look at the imaginary part, which is just minus i. And since that is not affected by our z, we can say, we can rewrite this limit as 5 plus 12i minus i, which is equal to 5 plus 11i. 